Welcome to the We On podcast, where we explore fascinating stories and ideas from various fields. In this episode, we uncover a strange new twist in the mystery of Three Eye Atlas, as a newly captured image reveals an unexpected sunward jet shooting toward the sun, raising fresh questions about its composition, behavior, and possible interstellar origins. It's a discovery that blurs the boundary between natural wonder and cosmic enigma. Interstellar comet 3i Atlas is displaying two anti-tail jets and a longer jet in the other direction in a new image shared by two British astronomers. They shared that the photo was taken on November 9th and is heavily processed to show the anti-tail and the smoking tail. It is a combination of a picture series taken with two telescopes which Michael Buchner and Frank Niebling shared. While the object once again has a tail, what baffles scientists is the other jets that seem to be directed towards the sun. Harvard scientist Avi Loeb wrote that the picture shows two anti-tail jets out to 10 arc minutes towards the sun, accompanied by a longer collimated jet. The sunward jets measure 0.95 million kilometers while the tail jetting away from the sun is about 2.85 million kilometers long. This is way bigger than the glowing halo around 3i Atlas captured by the Hubble Space Telescope on July 21st. Loeb says the size of the jets means that particle probes on Earth-based satellites won't be able to capture the particles since 3i Atlas will be 269 million kilometers at its nearest point from Earth about a hundred times larger than the extent of the jet structure seen in the latest images. He says the same goes for NASA's Juno spacecraft around Jupiter, which will observe it on March 16, 2026, from a distance of 53 million kilometers. ESA's JUICE spacecraft, traveling to Jupiter, is currently 64 million kilometers from 3i Atlas and won't be able to intercept these jets either. Loeb has pointed out a strange feature of the jet. He cites that the solar wind flows at a speed of about 400 kilometers per second, a thousand times larger than the outflow speed from a natural comet. But in the case of the anti-tail seen in 3i Atlas, the outermost mass density is a million times bigger than that of the solar wind. He inferred, based on the observations and his calculations, that the diameter of 3i Atlas must be bigger than 5 kilometers. If it is a natural comet and most of its nucleus survived perihelion, then the diameter of 3i Atlas should be 10 kilometers or larger. He once again raised doubts over its mass, which is likely over 50 billion tons, at least a million times more than the inferred mass of 1i Oumuamua. This, he says, is almost impossible to happen before we see much smaller interstellar objects. Thanks for tuning into this incredible story. If this episode resonated with you, don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button for more captivating stories to come. Stay tuned.